Ever look up at the night sky and think, man, I wish I had my own moon? Well, guess what? Earth just got itself a new celestial sidekick, and it's not what you'd expect. Imagine this. You're scrolling through your usual space news feed, expecting the same old updates about Mars rovers or black holes, when suddenly, bam, Earth has a new mini-moon. That's right. Our planet just scored itself a tiny temporary companion, and astronomers are buzzing. Now I know what you're thinking. Wait, what? A mini-moon? Is this some kind of cosmic joke? Nope. It's 100% real science, my friends. And over the next few minutes, we'll dive into this astronomical surprise party. We'll unpack what exactly a mini-moon is, how this little space rock managed to cozy up to our planet, and why it's got scientists more excited than a kid in a candy store. Plus, we'll explore what this means for the future of space exploration and our understanding of the solar system. So, strap in, fire up that curiosity, and let's embark on a journey to meet Earth's newest, albeit temporary, lunar companion. Trust me, by the end of this video, you'll be the go-to expert in your friend group for all things mini-moon. Let's go! Now, before we dive into the nitty-gritty of our new celestial neighbor, let's talk about what a mini-moon is. Don't worry, it's not some kind of lunar diet fad. In the simplest terms, a mini-moon is a small asteroid that's been temporarily captured by Earth's gravity. These cosmic visitors aren't permanent fixtures like our good old moon. Instead, they're more like celestial tourists, dropping by for a quick orbit or two before heading back out into the vast expanse of space. Think of it like this. Imagine Earth as a giant cosmic merry-go-round. As it spins through space, sometimes small objects get caught up in its gravitational pull. These objects start orbiting Earth, like how you might circle that merry-go-round. But just as you hop off the ride, these mini-moons eventually break free from Earth's gravity and continue their journey through space. Now you might wonder, how common are these mini-moons? Well, they're pretty rare. Since we started looking for them, we've only confirmed two other mini-moons orbiting Earth. The first, dubbed 2006 RH120, visited us from September 2006 to June 2007. The second, 2020 CD3, was with us from 2018 to 2020 but we only noticed it in February 2020, just a few months before it left our orbit. Talk about a shy guest. So it's a big deal when astronomers spot a new mini-moon. It's like finding a cosmic needle in a haystack, if that haystack was, you know, the entire solar system. Now that we've explained mini-moons, let's discuss how our latest celestial visitor was discovered. Buckle up because this is where the story gets fascinating. On February 15, 2023, astronomers at the Mount Lemmon Observatory in Arizona were doing their usual sky survey. These surveys are like cosmic treasure hunts, where astronomers scan the night sky, looking for anything new or unusual. And boy, did they hit the jackpot that night. Using a 1.5-meter telescope, they spotted something unusual, a faint object moving across the sky in a way that didn't quite match known asteroids or space debris. After some initial observations and calculations, they realized they might have stumbled upon something special, a potential new mini-moon for Earth. Discovering a mini-moon is more complex than spotting it once. To confirm its orbit and nature, astronomers needed to track it over several nights and combine data from multiple observatories. It's like trying to predict the path of a fly buzzing around your room, but on a cosmic scale. The discovery was reported to the Minor Planet Center, the central hub for all things related to small bodies in our solar system. 
they gave it the temporary designation 2023DW, astronomers speak, for we found something cool in 2023 and we're still figuring out what it is. What's impressive about this discovery is the technology involved. The telescope that first spotted our new mini-moon is part of the Catalina Sky Survey, a NASA-funded project to discover and track near-Earth objects. These are the same systems that help us spot potentially hazardous asteroids, so they're crucial for keeping an eye on our cosmic neighborhood. The fact that we can spot these tiny objects – remember, many moons are typically only a few meters across – is a testament to how far our astronomical technology has come. It's like being able to spot a golf ball from hundreds of miles away. Now that we know how this cosmic visitor was discovered, let's get to know it better. What exactly are we dealing with here? Our new mini-moon, officially designated as 2023DW, is believed to be an asteroid about 1 to 2 meters in diameter. To put that in perspective, it's roughly the size of a small car. So, while it might be called a moon, it's not something you'd see lighting up the night sky. In terms of its composition, astronomers believe it's likely a rocky body, similar to many of the asteroids in the inner solar system. However, we can't say what it's made of without studying it up close. It could be a chunk of rock, a metallic body, or even a loosely bound pile of smaller rocks held together by gravity. One of the most intriguing aspects of 2023DW is its orbit. Unlike our permanent moon, which orbits in a nice, predictable ellipse, this mini-moon's path around Earth is much more complex. It's caught in what astronomers call a horseshoe orbit. Imagine a horseshoe-shaped path that loops around both Earth and the Sun. Our mini-moon travels along this path, alternating between being pulled closer to Earth and drifting farther away. This dance between the gravitational pulls of Earth and the Sun keeps the mini-moon in its temporary orbit. What's particularly exciting about 2023DW is how long it's expected to stick around. According to initial calculations, this little space rock is set to orbit Earth for about two months. That's a decent visit in cosmic terms. Now, you might wonder, can we see this mini-moon? Unfortunately, 2023DW is far too small and dim to be visible to the naked eye. Even with most amateur telescopes, it would be extremely challenging to spot. This mini-moon is only visible to large, professional-grade telescopes. But don't let that disappoint you. The fact that we can't see it doesn't make it any less exciting or important. In fact, its small size and temporary nature are part of what fascinates scientists. Speaking of scientists, they're thrilled about this new arrival. But why? What makes this tiny space rock so exciting to the astronomical community. Many moons like 2023DW are incredibly valuable for several reasons. First, they provide a unique opportunity to study near-Earth objects up close. While two months might not seem like a long time to us, it's a golden opportunity for astronomers to gather data on an object in our cosmic backyard. These observations can tell us a lot about the composition and behavior of minor asteroids. This information is crucial for understanding the formation and evolution of our solar system. It's like getting a free sample of the early solar system delivered to our doorstep. Moreover, studying mini-moons can help refine our models of objects moving in near-Earth space. This is incredibly important for predicting the paths of potentially hazardous asteroids. The more we understand how these small bodies interact with Earth's gravity, the better we can protect our planet from potential impacts. 
Many moons also offer exciting possibilities for future space exploration. Some scientists have proposed using these temporary visitors as potential targets for sample return missions. Imagine being able to capture a piece of a passing asteroid without having to travel deep into space. It's like cosmic fishing, but with much higher stakes. There's also the potential for mining these objects. While 2023 DW is too small to be a viable target, larger mini-moons could be rich in valuable resources. As we look towards a future of space colonization and exploration, having accessible sources of raw materials in near-Earth orbit could be a game-changer. But perhaps most excitingly, mini-moons like 2023 DW remind us of how dynamic and ever-changing our cosmic environment is. The space around Earth isn't empty. It's a bustling highway of asteroids, comets, and now we know temporary moons. Each discovery like this opens up new questions and avenues for research, pushing the boundaries of our understanding of the universe. I know what some of you might think. This is all very exciting. But is there any chance this mini-moon could hit Earth? It's a fair question, especially given all the sci-fi movies we've seen about asteroid impacts. The good news is that 2023 DW poses absolutely no threat to Earth. Its orbit has been carefully calculated, and astronomers are confident it will peacefully go on its way after its two-month visit. Objects of this size enter Earth's atmosphere fairly regularly. We call them meteors or shooting stars when we see them burning up in the night sky. So, while we can't see our new mini-moon with our own eyes, we can rest easy knowing it's up there, silently orbiting our planet and providing valuable data to scientists worldwide. As we wrap up our cosmic journey, let's take a moment to reflect on what we've learned. We've discovered that Earth has a new temporary companion, a mini-moon named 2023 DW. This small asteroid, roughly the size of a car, will be orbiting our planet for about two months. We've learned that mini-moons are rare and exciting finds, providing valuable opportunities for scientific study. They offer insights into the composition of asteroids, the dynamics of near-Earth space, and even potential resources for future space exploration. The discovery of 2023 DW is a testament to the incredible advancements in our astronomical technology and the tireless work of sky surveys like the one at Mount Lemmon Observatory. It reminds us that there's still much to discover in our cosmic backyard. But most importantly, this little space rock is a cosmic wake-up call. It reminds us that the universe is a dynamic, ever-changing place with wonders waiting to be discovered. Every time we look up at the night sky, we gaze into a vast frontier of knowledge with discoveries waiting beyond our current understanding. If you enjoyed this video, please let us know and check out one of our other fascinating videos on the channel. Until next time, keep looking up, stay curious, and remember, there's always something new to discover in the vast expanse of space.